Oof. Eight days left, guys. Vendors refer ingredients from more dangerous... Oh. <laughs> Maybe I should stop reading those out loud. <laughs> Just gotta take this one day at a time. Oh wow, this is an actual potion shop? I could have sworn it was all boarded up just the other day. And now, potions! Uh, yeah. Pardon the mess. I've been working to get the place up and running again. Well, I'm impressed. You must know what you're doing. That's really kind of you. The truth is, I'm new to town and new to running a shop. I'm sort of figuring it all out as I go. Really? I'm new here too. My name's Mint and I just got to town a few days ago, really. Uh I'm Sylvia, resident potions witch, and by resident, I mean I literally live here. It's seriously good to meet you, Sylvia. And now I have to ask, does Foster the formidable ever shop here? Or Doc's the defense defense straighter? Um That would be a huge honor, but I'm not sure I recognize them. You didn't have a poster of them in your bedroom when you were little? I guess that was just me. I may be a bit of a fangirl to be honest. I've been geeking up pretty much non-stop since I got here. I mean, this island has a lot of historical significance to the Heroes Guild. This is where... This is where they defeated Maven, the Witch Queen of Rafton. Of course. The fallout from that battle left the island inhabitable, inhabitable for a little while. The whole place is rebuilding now, and that includes the local chapter of the Guild. They put out a call for new recruits. Um... You've got the muscles. You've got the muscles to be a hero. Ever thought about joining? Aw, oh, thanks. I do work out. <laughs> Yikes. As a matter of fact, joining up is exactly why I came to Raptor. I answered the call. Hey, that's great. Congratulations. Congrats on the new gig. Thanks. But I'm only a provisional member for now. They've got me running odd jobs for the XP. Oh, that's slang for experience. Any day now, I'll be ready for a proper adventure. Proper adventures outside the town. After all, that's the whole. There's a whole island out there, human with mystery and danger, and potions ingredients, of course. Oh, swing by the guild hall if you're lo ever looking for loot. I can help you out for a small fee. Sounds promising. Thanks for the tip. No sweat, Sylvia. I know we've just met, but I'm already rooting for you. That's going to work in your favor, I bet. Invoke sympathy to your customers, and they'll be even more likely to cut you some slack. Sympathy. Increases in all interest gained by 25%. Ooh. I'll definitely keep that in mind. And I have a feeling you're gonna do great. Now, if you excuse me, I've got some fetch quests to, to tackle. I wouldn't believe how often people in this town misplace family heirlooms. Oh, so we already got two pretty good cards already. Increases captain's customers, increasing customers. <laughs> so, we're out of ingredients. Can't make any more potions. Might as well check out Quinn's shop, right? Or else, there's always the Heroes Guild. I think we'll go to the Heroes Guild. Um, let's do this first before I forget. Hmm. I guess we'll get rid of those. And then... I mean, I really should get- maybe I'll get rid of these. There we go. Hmm, I see. Let's grab those potions. Bottle these up. Nice. Okay, so I guess we can make up our own concoction, and it won't actually make a potion sometimes. We'll put these on the shelf, and then we'll go back to the shelf for a lot. Let's go travel. Hmm. Let's go talk to her. Hi Sylvia, I'm so glad you decided to drop in on me. What do you think of the guild hall? Isn't it amazing? There's a lot more taxidermy than I expected. 
Yeah, heroes love their trophies. Maybe I'll be contributing one soon. Because get this, I've been approved to go adventuring. The training wheels are coming off. You should send me out sometime. I promise I'll bring back some great loot for you. How does that work exactly? I can tell you all about it. I just had my orientation and took detailed notes in my dedicated color-coded adventuring binder. Sounds complicated. Nah, I'm just a nerd for this stuff. It's actually a pretty simple system. Start by choosing which area you want me to explore. The farther I get into that area, the more loot I'll bring back. Find me with potions is totally optional, but the right potion could help me get farther. It might help me find a better sp or it might help me find better spoils. Every potion has its uses, but health potions and mana potions are by far the most important. Health potions help me withstand damage, and mana potions power my attacks, allowing me to fight my way past monsters. However, there's a limit to how many potions I can drink at a time. All that magic can really mess up a person's stuff. Oh, and don't forget, there's a fee every time you send me up. Those are set by the guild. That's about it. Consider me on call. Honestly, I can't get out there soon enough. I know you'll do amazing. I hope so. That's what I've been training for, after all. Oh, you also gave us a goodie bag of health and mana potions for new recruits. Let's use them on my first adventure. What? You just get six potions? Did I have some? Health potions to patch me up and mana potions to help me finish help me to the finish line. Let's use them both. And hey, thanks for the support, Sylvia. It means a lot. I'm hoping those voices are enough different. <laughs> hey, you found me. Okay. We could just hang out. Oh, lower straps. Good to know. Okay. Oh, where should we go today? Hmm, <laughs> only one place. Don't worry about me. I can handle it. Okay, so they'll deal two damage to her. So she has 20 health, so 5, 15. Okay, I'm gonna give her a mana potions. Why do we just send her out? Oh, I see. Oh, it looks like I'm gonna dominate out there. Oh, go ahead. I'll report back ASAP. Well, let's go. Oh, it only takes one to talk to two people. That's amazing. <laughs> and then, no, I wonder if I shop, if we'll just totally mess up everything. We meet again. I got a bit of everything. Ooh, I see, I see. Uh, should I just get Max? Um, I think so. I guess let's get four. And four of these. And we'll get eight of these. Cool. <laughs> we'll call that good. Should I? Should I just buy more? I mean... I feel like I should just buy more. I'm already here, you know what I mean? There we go. That one's fresh. Score. Oh, do you see the chest? It has teeth. <laughs> I didn't even notice that. That's cool. Okay, um... I wonder if I hang out. Uh, maybe, 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 maybe we'll just go back. Yeah, we'll just hit that. Wait, what? How do I? Do I have to hang out with her? Oh, what just happened? I guess I should click on me and that's how we go back. Something's loading. There we go. Welcome back. You'll probably want to get brewing soon, yes? Make your potions recipe book. Recipe book for all the possibilities. Remember, offering a variety of potions is key. While your potions brew, consider dropping in on your new acquaintances. Traveling takes time, so plan accordingly. Well, anyway, I think you need to take it from here. Remember, adapt and overcome. Okay. Oh, and take an early rest if you need it. Otherwise, you might get too stressed to function. Yeah, I think we're okay for now.
Uh, recipe book. We really don't know much. Okay. Wait, can we put these in here? Oh no. Oh, I get to keep those potions? I did not know that. That's it. I can only put four. Okay. Um, maybe we'll do... Wait, wait. Uh, I mean, I guess not. Wait, that's a bad idea. I don't know, we'll brew this. I don't know. Um, we'll put, do we want to sell another mana? I guess we may as well, right? Okay. Here we go. Let's see how well we do with these new cards. Hopefully we actually get them. Sell me something. How about this? Oh, it's the cheap one. Wait, what is this? Just is interest applied. Do we want to use this? Uh, we will. He's gonna shield himself? I guess I didn't really need that. Unfortunate. Five shield? Yikes, dude. I should have played that first. Okay, at least it's a cheap one. That's okay. Yeah, let's let's try and do a little bit better. Oh, maybe I... Yeah, I guess it doesn't really matter. That's gonna end that turn, right? Yeah, fortunate. I guess it did... We did get it for, uh... Okay, should we use this? Yes. Nice. Okay, cool. And then we close it out. That was, that was decent. Hey, Quinn! What is this? Bad cards, bad cards. Now that's two out of the four we won't have in the deck. Oh no. <laughs> ourselves. We'll end our turn. Oh. What is this? Oh. Okay, we gotta close the deal. That one wasn't great either, but that's okay. If that chick will already be back. Um, uh, mint. I don't really want to travel unless she's gonna be there. Okay. Brew that up. I see. Should we just travel anyway? Yeah, let's travel it. Why not? Uh, 
I wonder if it takes a whole day for her to come back. I guess we'll see. Oh, is she already back? Nice. Ooh. Oh, cool. And that's just wood. Oh, I wonder if that makes the potions cook instantly. The enchanted force was no sweat. I actually enjoyed being out there. I knew you could handle it, and I'm excited to use those ingredients you brought back. I found some other goodies too. Set them aside for you. These are glamours. They'll change the look of your shop. Oh, cool. They're purely cosmetic, so don't get any tangible. So don't expect any tangible benefits. Still, they're pretty cool, right? Um, yes. Amazing. Hey, thanks. I can see how it'd be nice to switch things up every now and then. No problem. I'll keep an eye out for more. Apparently some critters get into a shipment. Another got into a shipment and another spread all over the island. Which reminds me, I can re return to the forest any time. But I'm also up for more of a challenge. The mushroom mire and the bone waste are available for me now. They're a little more dangerous, but that means better rewards. And here's one more tip. You should introduce yourself to our guild master, Baptiste sends out daily expeditions, and if you invest in one, you'll get a share of what comes back. Oh, cool. I'll be sure to introduce myself. I'll keep you in mind for further adventures, too. Sounds good, Sylvia. I'm ready when you are. Cool. Um... Don't I have... The potions for it. Let's go back here. Oh, she only has attack. So mana means attack. I see. Let's do it anyway. Oh, it even says time required one. I see. Okay, let's go talk to him. Ah, so I should talk to, uh, build the relationship. One sec, guys, one sec. Okay, I'm back. Whoops, he said something about it being really huge. Greetings, fair patron. Greetings and welcome to the Heroes Guild. I'm Baptiste, esteemed guild master, and a fledgling barkeep. Hi, I'm Sylvia. I'm new to town, and I make potions. Then you'll be certainly then you'll certainly benefit from our services. Hiring a hero is a surefire way to get your hands on new ingredients. You can work directly with any hero you're acquainted with, or come to me. I always have a list of upcoming expeditions. Invest in one, and in return, you receive a portion of whatever loot is brought back. Wow! That sounds like the guild has a lot to offer. We aim to please. If there's anything else I can do to be of service, just let me know. How about sharing some pointers? Got any advice for a fellow merchant? Well, I don't know that I'm a merchant per se. I'm more of a facilitator. A master admis administrator, if you will. I keep everything running smoothly here in our town's great he While our he town's great heroes seek glory, adventure, and resources. It's almost, it almost sounds like you're bragging about being a bureaucrat. No, don't you know? Bureaucrats are highly lim, lynch, lin, <laughs> linchpin? They're the very linchpin holder holding society together. We don't call ourselves heroes, but if making an order of, of a chaotic world isn't heroic, I don't know what is. That's an interesting point of view, isn't it? And in striking up a conversation about it, I'm demonstrating a piece of advice you asked for. If you've got something to sell, the best to captivate your audience forthwith. Ooh. That's pretty good. I think I can manage that. The advice I've it's the advice I've recently taken to heart. I arrived here only a few months ago, intent on gilding this guild to greatness. And the heroes have greeted me with open arms, although some of their traditions are rather mystifying. Say, you look like a commoner. Maybe you could share some insights. You must be a noble, then? Haha, <laughs> I'm trying to downplay all that, you know, to help me fit in. That brings us to my question. 
Chum, tell me, this charming little tradition of leaving gifts in, you, in a new friend's shoes. Gifts? Yes, you know, like shaving cream and rotten fruit. <laughs> and that one time it was a scorpion. Is that all really go on for months? I mean, I'm flattered, but it's starting to feel like overkill. <laughs> Should I tell him the truth? <laughs> no. They must really like you, so just roll with it. They can't keep it up forever, right? I should hope not. Honestly, how much rotten fruit could there be in this place? But I shouldn't complain. I knew coming here there'd be a period of adjustment. Finding yourself suddenly in a new land and in a new role, it can be challenging, can't it? <laughs> Yikes. We'll get the hang of it. I mean, almost everyone in this town is, trans is a transplant. Indeed, in that sense, you and I fit in quite well. At any rate, it's been a pleasure making your acquaintance, Sylvia. I hope you decide to avail yourself to our service, and I trust we'll find the opportunity to chat again soon. Yeah, I'm not complimenting him. Calm down. <laughs> Greetings and salutations. Okay, let's invest. Oh, I see. Um, what should we use? <laughs> I don't know what the... I'm gonna say blue means good, red means bad, so... Oh, wow. Disrupts ecosystem? Oh, it's 25? 75 for one ore? What? That seems why. We'll do it. <laughs> why not? Um... And we'll talk to her. Hi. We can gift ingredients to others. Oh, I did not realize. Hey, Sylvia. I hear you. I heard you've been busy. Uh oh. What have you heard exactly? <laughs> Nothing special and especially interesting. Mint just mentioned you've been working for the Heroes Guild. She's too nice to give me the real gossip. That's a major shortcoming, if I'm honest. I didn't realize you two knew each other. I know all the heroes. After they go on their little adventures, they sell their trash items to me. It's basically my whole business model. Trash comes in, trash goes out. Of course, they keep the best stuff for their clients, so I'm guessing you've got some, something decent in your inventory for me. Maybe something I've never seen before. Give it here. Why? No, why would I do that? Suit yourself. I'm just trying to help you out. I know how this goes. You get your hands on a good ingredient, and you're all excited to use it in a potion, right? So you throw it in your cauldron, and poof, it's gone forever. Well, it doesn't have to be that way. What's the alternative? Easy. Hand it over to me instead. My clairvoyance lets me hone in on a specific ingredient, on specific ingredients. Meaning, if you give me something good, I'll be able to find more of it. And then I can start offering that ingredient for sale in my shop. You'll miss out on the instant, you'll miss out on the instant gratification, but you'll get guaranteed access to the ingredient in the future. Yeah, okay. I see how that could come in handy. I'll let you know if I s decide to take you up on it. There, see? Give me free stuff, and we all benefit. Mostly me, but still. I wouldn't expect you to operate any other way. But hey, since you're chummy with all the heroes, does this mean I'll be running into you at the guild hall? Nah. Despite all the invaluable services I provide to the heroes, I'm not exactly welcome in their clubhouse. You set one fire, and suddenly everybody acts like you're... Everybody acts like you're a real liability. You set two fires, and you get banned for life. Consider yourself warned, I guess. Now, did you want to buy something? Cool. Um, cool. Let's see. Oh, I see. Cool. Let's give her one of these. Oh, 
actually eat it. <laughs> I don't want to buy anything. Let's hang out with her for blind taste test. You can't succeed in this business if you can't tell a. Okay. Quinn pulls out a blindfold and, and a sack of ingredients. Sylvia is hesitant, but Quinn has a point. Sylvia uses this stuff in her crap. She should know her materials inside and out. She dons a blindfold and opens wide, bracing for whatever Quinn has in store. Some of the ingredients taste all right, others don't. That was fun. I'm not sure your palate is any sharper than before, but your projectiles vomit is something to envy. Oh no, it's just out more. Oh no, she's less stressed. Okay. Projectile vomiting now she is good. <laughs> I thought all of a sudden she gets more stressed. Um, I guess that means I can go back and collect ingredients. Oh, what? I didn't realize it was that late in the day. Yeah, that's okay. I know you wouldn't win. Ooh. Cool. Take that. Uh, do I want her to travel anymore? No, I'm out of potions. There's no point. I really just need to upgrade my cauldron so I can craft more. Mmm, how do those taste? Wonderful. <laughs> you could rank her up? Sure. I wonder what that does. I just need another cauldron, I guess. This is a sort of an unusual location for a business, isn't it? It has its parts. I do like the view. Can see the whole town. Yeah, so I can spot trouble coming a mile away. Listen, in business, you gotta use any advantage you've got, whether that's the high ground or a low blow. Got the upper hand, that's when you press the attack. Ooh, that's pretty good. I'm willing to make the most of an advantage. As soon as I get an advantage, I mean. Just now, I could use an advantage in the marketplace. You might fit the bill. Come on, follow me. Are we gonna go steal? Or is that the end of the conversation? Alright, here's the deal. There are a total of four chocolatiers in this town. Each one of them gives out one free sample per customer per day. Mm -hmm. What are you waiting for? Go get them! Bring them here! <laughs> Heard by the urgency in Quinn's voice, Cynthia plunges into the throng. The chocolate tears aren't hard to find. In, in a matter of minutes, she has four small chocolate treats. Yoink! Hey, wait a minute. What gives? You can't be that lazy. First of all, I wouldn't under I wouldn't underestimate my laziness if I were you. More to the point, I got a lifetime ban from those stalls. All four of them. What are you doing? You're setting fires to everything? Well, in that case, I'm glad I could help you out, I guess. Hey, don't be sore. I'll share if you want. But they use some unusual ingredients in these things. You never know what's inside until you take a bite. Unusual ingredients? As in monster parts? Among other things. Why use such strange ingredients? That's what they have access to. You gotta understand, this island was off limit for years. And all that time, the land was stewing in sweet, sweet magical juices. So pretty much anything you find here is gonna have some magic in it. I guess we have that dead witch to thank for that. Maybe. She performed some pretty out, out of their uh, out there experiments before the Heroes Guild took her took her out. It almost sounds like you admire her. Wasn't she evil? Better evil than boring. Maybe she could have taught me some things. Maybe I could have taught her some things. Anyway, the land Maven left behind is a pretty weird is a weird place, full of weird stuff. And I like weird. Weird is rare. Weird is valuable. The hard part is getting our hands on the best stuff. We need the local heroes to, you know, get good. They rely on potions when they're out there forging. So if you level up your craft, they get better. And you and I both benefit. We're in this together then. 
That's sort of sweet. Yeah, sure. Oh, look at her blush. Oh, I, I didn't even realize a giant eye on her hat. Super sweet. As long as you don't turn out to be dead weight. Now I gotta get back. Foxer gets angsty if I leave him for too long. She has a dog? And I get the impression. You got your work cut out for you. Cool. Yeah, I really like this game. Uh, let's go home. <laughs> oh wait, Boxer's the box. I'm so dumb. <laughs> oh, that's it. Oh. Well, unfortunate. 